Hello, AB1II here. Today I'm setting up to do an FT8 Pax on the Air POTA activation down the street at Quincy Shore Reservations. So I have the ICOM IC705, and there's two things I'd like to set on this before bringing it out into the field. One is um, the IC705 has a feature where it will charge off of the USB port. And that will probably help drain your laptop batteries if you're like me and I don't have power where I am and I want to conserve the laptop as long as possible. So I go into menu. I'm hitting the exit key. I go into menu. I've done so many cuts of this. I'm just going to go through this and then menu and then function and then here usb power input i already have it shut off but if you want to see what it looks like go in here and you can turn it on or off and then you hit the back button so it's off so i'll have one step to conserve the battery power the other thing i like to test do is uh i think there's one firmware upgrade since i bought the uh, ic705 which has a nice feature called presets. So you hit your menu and right in the right here. So if you're over here, it's on the number two menu. You hit your presets and it came with a nice built-in FT8 mode preset. And I just load that. And I can hit, hit now I can hit exit. And there we go. USB digital. And of course when I sync up with the um, WSJT, it'll put me on the right frequency for FT8 per band. So I'm going to start packing things up and hopefully it'll be a simple, quick activation today. Thanks. I'm using a different pack than previous videos because this will carry everything, including the laptop. So the IC705 just about fits inside this pocket here get the zone compartment and then here's where uh, the antenna system is spare battery coax and the tripod and then in this compartment I'll just slide the laptop in there and hopefully we're good to go I got 17 minutes or so before the the battery in the laptops fully charged so I'm gonna take a break and we should be getting going pretty soon. So one thing I checked before leaving is I have my keys. But also online, I went to one of the time sites to make sure that I have the uh, my times correct on my PC. That's critical for FT8. So I'm synced up. This will be my ham shack for the next hour or so. Let's find a spot out of the way. Okay, it's really nice out. Um, antenna set up, laptop, radio, tuner. Having a little bit of trouble with RF getting into the PC and smashing WSJT to pieces. So I moved the antenna around a little bit. Hopefully that'll help. Otherwise, this is a dead activation. Yeah, so this is uh, gonna be a wash. The PC keeps crashing because of RF going back into the uh, laptop. And, you know, I just, you now I'm getting low battery warnings on my PC. So maybe because this shows sometimes the 
good old simple CW Morse code f phone is the reliable mode. It's so cold out too, but the wind's constantly. And I can't, it's so distracting, so I'm gonna. Like, I mean, it's still no, it's fun. It's, it was fun to get out here and get some fresh air, but it was fun trying, but I'm not again. Uh, maybe I'll do FT8 in a more controlled environment. This is ridiculous. 7-3 for now. Enjoy the view here. So we're back home. We're back home. I'm gonna unpack and I'm gonna set the station back up inside the shack here. Leave the railroad frequencies on while I'm not home. I hope they catch a defect detector someday when the VHF band opens up. All right, let's let's reassemble the station here. And see what it, what went wrong. Well, we know what went wrong was getting RF back into the radio. So let's set up, make sure nothing's broken. And it goes to show. I have everything working here. Same cables, same in, same cable, same tuner, same radio, same PC. Works fine. Get that stuff out in the field. You got a crummy match on your uh, transmission line, and um, it's unstable. So let me get everything set up here and see what we can do. All right, so we're back on the air here in the shack. I'm transmitting um, on 10 meters, no RF feedback. Um, this is a South African station calling CQ. I, no, he doesn't hear me. They don't hear me. Um, I'm only running 10 watts into a vertical antenna on the roof. But we're happy here, nice and warm. So lesson learned. Just because it works in the shack, does it mean it's going to work in the field? 7.30. So I am doing okay on 10 meters. About 12.42 p.m. local time, Eastern time. Probably play around here in the shack a little bit long more and uh, oh okay I think I got Brazil here PY5EJ so hopefully it stays consistent they'll hear me to finish this cue so nice all right everybody take care seven three